ask you uh, pl point blank. What's the rundown of the news today at 6.55? <laughs> You're asking me, I don't know. You'll have to ask the uh, director of news. Are you sure you do not? No, I don't know. I don't know a thing about what's happening. Here. And how do you get to know your news? I watch it in the <laughs> evening at home. Like everybody. Yeah. See, this is one of the criticism that has been leveled against uh, TV Dharana, Dharana, other Dharana, uh, this news brand which is very strong in Sri Lanka and not only in Sri Lanka, all over the world. Even Sri Lankans are looking for other Dharana in order to uh, know what's happening here. Yeah. And, and they trust it. Um, what they say is there is no journalistic freedom in, 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 in for the newsroom, for the news editor. No, you all are the ones who are the puppet masters. You, uh, uh, Mr. Madhava, Mr. Dilit, Mr. Varuni, everybody is the puppet masters trying to do this and that. Uh, how do you respond to that? Is, that is, is, is there any truth to that? There's absolutely no truth to that, uh, Mahesh. Uh, the news department has absolute uh, they are absolutely independent. They have their journalistic freedom and if there is something that is run on the news, they are responsible for it. We are not. The owners, especially Dilit Jaivira and Varunia Munangbal. You know Dilit has an office here, it started yeah. recently here. Have you seen him up here? <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't even yeah. come up here. I've so, been trying my yeah. best to get him to sit here but no, that no, I have he failed doesn't, as well. He doesn't. And, uh, there is no, no direction of uh, news from our quarters. Why do it's you believe that? What's yeah. the reason? Because we know in Sri Lanka, yeah. pretty much all media institutions are invested by the investors to do their dirty deeds, to utilize that particular organization to pretty much do what they want. It started, I think, after the state television uh, that, you know, when private uh, channels started coming in, he saw that they were driving the mentality of Sri Lanka the way they want that would pretty much uh, benefit them. So, why aren't you doing that? You can benefit from it. Uh, it's a very difficult question to answer because I don't get involved at all. And uh, the, the, the news is not directed by anyone here. And do you need that? I mean, do you need to do that? They, they are just independent. They have their own journalistic freedom. And have you ever seen uh, people giving their own opinion in, in our news program? No. No, I mean, I mean, our, is, uh, there are opinion programs. This is yeah. one, right? Then uh, Chatura uh, reads his uh, newspapers in the morning. There in Aruna. Hey, that's a journalistic pro program. And that's his opinion there. Not our opinion, that's his opinion. But in the news, in the main news, we don't give our opinion. It's just news. So news is news. If it happens somewhere, they go and report the news. So, so people might see that as some kind of bias because they are looking at it from, uh, you know, looking through colored glasses. But uh, we don't, we don't uh, get involved at all. There was a story about a snake. There was a story. <laughs> yeah, the famous <laughs> snake story. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So all that. Uh, there was a story about uh, uh, shaman's tonic. Uh, uh, this <laughs> and that, and they, everybody uh, uh, pointed the finger at Dharana and said, what are you guys doing? What's this nonsense? Why are you eating the society? How do you respond to that? Mahesh, we don't get involved, but if you are head of an organization, you have to defend your people. So in defense of the news department, let's take the snake story. The head priest of a very important, not in some, some, not in some remote mm. corner of the island, of a very important temple, says he cited uh, a snake. The and there is folklore in the yeah. that area about Naga Vimana and uh, the you know if you know a little bit of history, yeah. right? It was Naga Rajadani. Uh, and uh, and uh, that was news. So, what we said in our news was that he saw, he says he saw the snake coming out. We didn't say we saw the snake coming out. That would have been our opinion. You see, 
you know about Loch Ness monster. Yeah. <laughs> yes. That's a folk tale. They are in Scotland. Yeah. Right? If there is a sighting of this Loch Ness monster, it's reported by the yeah. news there. The so BBC why why uh, so okay, Loch Ness monster is in the west? It's okay. <laughs> Here it's Naga. You know, it's in our local. Yeah. Then it's a local. Are, yeah, yeah. See, the thing is, we are. <laughs> we can't have double standards. Yeah. They are. They report the news of uh, sighting of the Loch Ness monster. We report the news of the sighting of the Naga in Kalanir. What's the difference?